And so this is the RFID uh, Arduino st starter kit. Um, and it has quite a few components in it, quite a nice package in my view. Um, to get started, uh, I'll just do a basic run through of some of the components. In here you'll find some LEDs, especially in there there's an um, infrared, universal infrared uh, detector or sensor. Um, here are some trimmers, um, a piezo buzzer in the uh, This is a ULN what, 204 uh, motor driver, so you can control stepper motors. This is a, a real-time clock, um, nice that you already have a battery included, and then obviously you get a breadboard here, and then add it to this. Okay, so you basically have a bunch of display units, 7-segment displays, matrix displays, I'm not sure what this chip is. That is a SN74HC595N. Uh, um, I'm not sure, I can't remember what, what exactly that is. Now, in here you've got some additional, quite quite a few additional sensors, such as this is a microphone uh, sensor, this is a relay unit, this is a, I believe, a temperature uh, humidity sensor, um, I mean, this is a joystick module that you have included in here, you get a, basically a, an adapter to apply, um, you know, to provide, to connect to a 9 volt battery, and power your Arduino. In here there is also an Arduino itself, um, you know, there at, below at the bottom there is the Arduino. Uh, you get a bunch of jumper cables, you get the programmer essential, if you want to program it, you need the USB cable, a lot uh, more jumper cables. You get a stepper motor in here, um, there is a servo motor included as well. Um, then you've got some, okay, yeah, this is a, a, a water level sensor. Um, Below that, okay, this is just the normal matrix keyboard. Uh, then you've got the actual RFID uh, package, which is uh, basically the reader, writer, and the tag, two tags, um, two types of tags. So, and that's it. I'm not sure actually why they call it an RFID uh, um, kit because there's so many additional things. So, from my point of view, it's just a great uh, uh, starter kit to have. Uh, well, pretty much a touch on everything, you know, the water sensor, the water level sensors, the real time clock, which if you ever want to need to keep track of time in any sense of way, you definitely need a real time clock. If you want to control the motor, um, any uh, stepper motors and uh, even um, DC motors, you can control it by this one. And I know this is quite a high, high performance one. Uh, so, I mean, in here you've got a display unit, which I also didn't, didn't mention. mention. Okay, you can't see it very nicely, but it is a LCD display unit. Then you've got the, RF, uh, the re infrared remote control in there as well. So I believe it's a pretty good kit. Um, 